Well, joining us now to give his view on whether New Zealand should become a republic is Te Pāti Māori co-leader Rawiri Waititi. Thank you for being with us this evening. What do you think? Should we go it alone? Well, no, I don't like to use um, you know, Pākehā ideologies like uh, Republic because it takes away the mana of tangata whenua and tangata treaty to be able to write an upper constitution or constitutional model underpinned by the Tiriti of Waitangi that allows us to create a truly Tiriti-centric Aotearoa. Uh, those, of you, those of you that know about uh, Matiki Mai report, there's examples of, in there of a tino rangatira tanga sphere, which is tangata whenua, and the Klawana tanga sphere, which is tangata treaty, who have their own autonomy and a constitution that recognises uh, the validity of both spheres and also ensuring a relational sphere which is uh, connected between the two when there needs to be synergy. Uh, that, should be, that, should, that should be done together. This is the true realisation of the Te Riti Waitangi. So, no, not a republic, but something more unique based on that's underpinned by Te Riti Waitangi. Well, let's talk more about the treaty because there's been a lot of talk about how we incorporate it into a new system, how we retain that partnership because it was written up between the Crown and Māori. Um, how do you think we move forward in um, not a republic but a new system? Well, to me, nothing happens with the Te Riti Waitangi. If I were, if I were Pākehā, I would protect the Te Riti Waitangi and any future ambitions for Aotearoa. It's the only validation for Kawanatanga government and for Pākehā to be here. So I'm just saying that this is a, this is not, Te Riti Waitangi has always been a cry for Ma, from Māori to honour it. But in actual fact, in the building and the, um, uh, and the development of a, of a, um, a constitution, the Te Riti Waitangi must be there to ensure it protects uh, not just Māori, not just tangata whenua, but also tangata tiriti. Um, there are so many options here, aren't there, about how we would actually do it. We, would we have a president like the US? Would we appoint more a symbolic head of state? What kind of system would you prefer? No, I, 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 I don't think it's, it's any of those if, <laughs> if we have a look at it. So like I said, there's a tino rangatira tanga sphere and there's a kawana tanga sphere. So it's not having a head of state that's a head of both those spheres. It's allowing the autonomy of those two spheres to be able to operate um, in their own manner. And so it's not, about, it's not a priority for us until we've had the mature conversation about what a constitution and constitutional model will look like for Aotearoa that's underpinned by the city or Waitangi. Only then will we be able to answer the questions.